Dame Helen Mirren was on the red carpet last night for her new superhero movie, Shazam! Fury of the Gods. Well, Dame Helen Mirren joins me now. What fun <laughs> you must have! You must have had such good fun. You're a total badass in this. Yes, yes, a kind of a badass, you know. We, we think we're the heroines of the story, of course, because we think we're utterly righteous in, in our effort to get our power back. But I, I think the fun of the film is the confrontation between these sort of classical, very serious... Um, sort of characters, and I thought it was a brilliant idea to, to have the idea of gods and uh, goddesses coming from the, you know, from thousands of years ago to reclaim their, um, you know, their, their territory from these, from these annoying, <laughs> young, uh, you know, hip Americans who've stolen it. Well, exactly. What I like about it is it's funny, it's silly, but it also has a big heart. And, you know, it really shows that the heroes are the underdogs. And I love that because I think, I think a lot of kids will really identify with them. And it's a great message. I completely agree, Lorraine. And, you know, that was the reason I wanted to do it because I felt that about the first Shazam. Yeah. And I'm not a big superhero sort of, it's not my sort of style of movie particularly, but I had seen Shazam and I'd been utterly charmed by it for that, that very reason that you, that you just articulated. And so when I was asked to be in, in the second one, you know, I, I jumped at it. Very much so. I tell you what, those costumes are fantastic, but apparently really, really heavy. They were incredibly heavy. I mean, I've worn some heavy costumes in my, in my life. Nothing compared <laughs> to the heaviness of these costumes. But of course, being an actress, you know, uh, and it gave you swagger. That was yes. the great thing about oh, those yes. costumes. With the cloak and the, and the sort of Roman skirt swishing around, you know, all made of real leather. Um, but it was, it was very, very heavy. We were shooting in Atlanta in the middle of summer which is notoriously hot and, and, um, and moist. <laughs> yes. So we were very hot and moist in our costumes. I'll bet you were, especially with real leather. Oh, yes, absolutely. Stunts, did you do all your oh, own stunts? Yes. I, did, I did do some... I mean, I worked, obviously, with stunt coordinator and stunt people, but I did do some stunts. In fact, Good. I broke my finger rather famously. Oh. This, you see that bent finger and yeah. that straight finger. This so. I now call my Shazam finger. <laughs> Uh, so I, I'll take it to the grave with me. You know, uh, we're talking of the costumes. Yeah. When we first, when uh, you, that was my first sense of what, how big this film was going to be, because you know you go to these amazing costume builders and they build them, and the first thing they do is they scan your body, so they have an ex exact measurement, and then the the costume is very specifically built to your proportions exactly, you know. So it's it's literally, literally built on you. Oh, that's amazing. Um, and then all hand-painted. Yeah. I mean, it was an amazing experience to go uh, to that, um, do you get that costume to keep that? Do you get to keep that costume? Because it's not going to fit anyone else, so you think that they would just <laughs> give it to you and you could <laughs> strut around in it? <laughs> No, I don't get to keep it. <laughs> you see me turning up at a cocktail party in London, you know, wearing that <laughs> I'd like that to costume. see that. Can I just say, I love, I know, but I love your hair. It looks brilliant and I loved it in the movie as well. It looks so, you, it's so yes. elegant, it's gorgeous. You're not, you're not supposed to have longer hair after a certain age. But um, during COVID, I started growing my hair and, and I hadn't actually had long hair since I was sort of in my 20s, you know, so... And it was sort of grew and grew and grew, and I couldn't be bothered to cut it, basically. Um, and then I thought, you know what, it's pretty cool. I think I'll stick with it for a little while. Yeah. And so it, it will come off eventually, but I'm kind of enjoying it. It's, it's, uh, it's quite radical. No, I think it's beautiful. You, you really, really suit it. It looks absolutely gorgeous. And I loved, I loved seeing you at the BAFTAs. That yes, was and a... it was great. Yeah, wasn't that lovely, that, that whole yes. speech that you did? It was, it was beautiful. Oh, for the Queen, yes. Yes, yes that, was, that, that, that was very moving, uh, very moving to do that. And, and, and a great honour to be asked to do that, actually. Yeah. No, it was. You're doing some really interesting work. I would say the past sort of 10 years, so, so much really interesting and, and such a, a diverse amount of work. You know, we've got Shazam, but then we've got the, the prequel to Yellowstone, which I 
absolutely love it. I'm right in the middle of it just now, 1923. I have done very diverse things in the past, you know, two years. And, it, it, you know, it's, it, that's what makes my life so fun, <laughs> you know, to go from doing Golda or 1923 mm. to doing Shazam, you know, is, um, you know, it, it really is what, what we enjoy as actors is, is jumping into all these different worlds. And it's International Women's Day today. Um, please just continue doing what you're Yay. doing. Just do what you do. It's, it, it's wonderful. Um, you, I don't know whether you are aware of what a kind of like, you know, a, an icon you are, not just with, not just with things. You know, we've talked about hair and we've talked about style and all of that, but it's so much more than that. Just by, just by doing what you do, um, you're always flying the flag for, for women of, well, women that are over 60. Yes, absolutely. And, um, you know, life doesn't stop and creativity doesn't stop and passion doesn't stop and energy doesn't stop, you know, unless you decide to stop it. Um, so it, it, it's just to be self-motivated, really, um, and, 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 and never, you know, never give up and, and find enjoyment. If, if it's possible in your life. I know that all people have terrible... And as you get older, you understand the struggles that people go through, um, either, you know, physical struggles or financial struggles. Uh, and life is tough. Life is very, very tough, very demanding. Um, but you... Uh, 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 and therefore, all the more reason to maintain your energy as far as you can and your health as far as you can. Yes, exactly. Important. You're a wise, wise woman. Thank you for everything that you do. <laughs> Everybody can go and see Shazam. It will cheer you up. It's funny, it's silly, it's fabulous. Thank it you will. so much for joining us this morning. It's always a joy. Thank you so much. Thank you, Lorraine. Great to see you. And Shazam Fury of the Gods is out in cinemas next Friday.